everyone! Today I'm doing the what's in my bag tag and it was requested by my good friend Lillian. So thank you for requesting the video and I'm sorry it's taken me so long to do. I finally decided to do this video because I figured since I quite enjoy watching other people's what's in my bag videos, I guess I would share my own. This is the bag that I use for uni. Uh, so in it at the moment is what I would usually take to uni on an just an average day like so the bag itself uh, I got this from Valley Girl it's just like an average black fake leather bag starting off I'll just give you an overview of kind of the main compartments sorry this here we go, uh, this is just like my study notes and things, um, I have this compartment that's like a big makeup bag really, just smaller items that I don't want to have to dig for like all the way underneath my bag. Yeah, I guess I'll start off with the bigger items. Uh, I have four subjects. I have four of these exact same folders. Um, like label myself. Inside, I like how it's uh, clear and I can kind of see what's inside it. Um, I got this from Daiso. It's a two ring binder. I print off my own lecture notes and then like punch holes in them and pop them in here. So it keeps everything pretty organized. Next I have these like other random notes and things. I like to keep them in this kind of, it's like a clear plastic pocket. So then I can just chuck it in my bag and it won't get like crumpled up and stuff. And then I have also this notebook from Daiso. It's got like pretty decent quality paper, which I think is important. Um, I don't know, it just feels better when you're writing on it. <laughs> like, this is actually smaller than A4, I don't know if you can tell, but yeah, I don't like the A4 size ones because they're kind of heavier and I don't fill up the whole page anyways, so I like to buy the, I don't, it's not exactly A5 either, um, it's just kind of in between A4 and A5. I think it's the perfect size for taking notes and stuff um, if you're a uni student. I have to have a diary, like a physical diary, um, where I write down like important dates and assignments that are due and things like that. Um, yeah. So the diary that I'm using at the moment I wouldn't exactly recommend because it's very ordinary, <laughs> um, but it does the job for me. I spent forever trying to pick a diary this year because when I went to Muji to get same diary from 2015 um, that I was using, which I freaking love. They didn't have it in stock. What I like about the Muji one, it has like the Monday to Friday all across here, and then it has hour by hour from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. So this way, I it's kind of like your to-do list, but it's the weekly to-do list. So. Yeah, I like that kind of layout. So I highly recommend Muji's Diaries. I do bring a laptop to uni. I actually got my MacBook Air from eBay. Almost perfect condition. It just had like tiny little dents on the side, but it's really unnoticeable and it works perfectly fine. So, and I managed to save like, I think like $600 on it. Because this model was from 2012. So yeah, this is the laptop that I use for uni. And I carry it in this laptop case. It's like furry on the inside and I like the colour of it. Uh, it's just pretty simple but it does the job for me. Drink bottle. Pencil case. I love the colour of this pencil case. I got it from Kiki K um, and it's also been a couple of years now. Okay, so let's talk about my stationery. So in here I have a whiteout from Daiso again, mechanical pencil thing, I'm not sure where I got it from. I'm pretty big on highlighters. Um, I got these highlighters from Daiso as well. 
um, they're double ended so this is like the finer end for writing and stuff and this is like the normal highlighter so yeah I have these four colors this highlighter from typo I highly recommend these um, because the special thing is that they're not only a highlighter they have an erasable end so when you highlight things in like your textbooks and stuff um, that costs like hundreds of dollars or whatever you can erase it for color pen um, because you know having everything in one is always handy my favorite pen is this one it has just like your black and then blue and red and it costs like five bucks I love this pen I just like I don't know my handwriting comes out really neat when I use this pen so every time I run out um, I always go back to this one yes finally I have my hand cream which I just stick in my pencil case oh I'm almost out of it but yeah this is my favorite hand cream it's the lost it limited edition violet hand cream this actually came with um, some magazine that I got and yeah I ended up really loving this um, and they don't actually have it in stores anymore which I'm kind of sad about and it has a really nice smell like I didn't know that I would like the smell of violet so much but yeah I do like the smell of violet <laughs> this bag now I'm not sure if you saw before but in here I have lots of random things <laughs> okay so I have public transport card my key card and um, like concession card I keep it in like this handy little thing so I can pop it out in earphones I want some better earphones like I don't know if you guys can recommend a good brand or good model of headphones um yeah i would love to know what kind of headphones you guys use have my keys i uh, keep it together with this little thing and this little <laughs> elephant i think is so cute um my sister got it from somewhere and then i was like oh my gosh that's so cute can i have it and she's like yeah kleenex okay <laughs> girl things <laughs> Oh, these are my glasses. Um, these ones are actually probably like my favorite glasses to wear. I like that the lenses aren't too dark. They're actually very light. So yeah, I love these glasses. Trusty Nude by Nature. It pretty much features in every single one of my videos I know. Poor ointment, very basic, must have. Moisturizing lotion from like a bigger tub but I just kind of transferred it into this smaller one because it's easier to carry around and yeah so that's that this little bag is so adorable my friend Trisha got it for me um, it was so sweet of her and yeah I just love it because it has this wide mirror and just kind of flaps up like this like I keep my kind of essential makeup thing makeup items in here so I'll just quickly go through this my cream con uh, cream foundation which I also use as a concealer um, this NYX love in Paris palette which is from Lillian um, she got it for me for my birthday and it has like all the basic colors on there that are you know perfect for um, this one I actually use to fill in my brows as well it's um like a dark matte shade and then yeah the other colors are all very neutral and it's just perfect for any occasion so I just keep that in my bag have this handy little brush thing tinted lip balm by Natio brow setting gel thing from Anastasia this Innisfree skinny mascara have uh, this lip tint from Tony Molly in Delight. Yep. Here I have this gel, black gel liner, and I use this tiny little brush, which is perfect for you know just getting right in there. 
between the lashes. The lip liner from IT Cosmetics or IT Cosmetics. Um, it says YLBB Your Lips But Better. Um, it's a waterproof lip liner stain. Um, yeah, so I have this on my lips at the moment. It also has a sharpener, which I just realized. <laughs> okay, so yeah. It's actually, um, it was really, it's quite pricey, this one. Um, but because I was looking for a retractable lip liner, because I can't be bothered, you know, sharpening a pencil all the time. The Innisfree No Sebum Mineral Powder. It has like a minty smell to it. Um, it's so cute. It's got this little like pad thing. And then you Finally, I have my wallet. It's a bit too bulky for my liking. Um, yeah, it weighs a bit too much for me. Gum, juicy fruit, and this is my USB stick. I add, which I added a little pink hair tie thing on so that I will be less likely to lose it. So that brings me to the end of the video. I have finished showing you everything in my bag. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did and let me know in the comments below what kind of video you'd like to see next. Yeah, I hope you guys are all well and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys! I'm on a world tour.